going everyone Brady here back to talk about the NFL playoffs once again we just had the divisional round end minutes ago the Seahawks just lost to the Packers so now I'm back to talk about my predictions for the divisional round and then look ahead to the AFC and NFC championships coming next weekend so we'll start with the first game from this previous weekend and it was the Vikings in the 49ers with the uh, the Niners getting the win there 27 to 10 and I think this is one that we all saw coming I did predict the 49ers would get the win here so I'm one for one in that category but I think the 49ers were just the better team here and they played like it Vikings got some magic against the Saints the week before, but they weren't able to replicate it. Vikings going out, and the 49ers moving on. The night game on Saturday between the Titans and Ravens was probably the biggest upset of the entire 2020 NFL playoffs, where the Titans overcame the Ravens 28-12. to I don't think anyone saw this one coming, so I certainly got this prediction wrong, but credit to the Titans. They played really well offensively and defensively, made the Ravens just not even look like themselves. So now in two weeks, the six-seeded Titans have knocked off the Patriots, and now the Ravens, they're steamrolling their way through all the way to the AFC Championship. To kick off play on Sunday, was the Chiefs getting the 51 to 31 win in an absolute shootout against the Texans and I think this one was certainly in the balance early on I thought there may be a chance for the Texans to surprise some people and steal this one and they came close they jumped out to a pretty strong lead early on but the Chiefs came right back and credit to them the Chiefs offense became the Chiefs offense and the playoff Texans became the playoff Texans so the Chiefs winning made me two for three on predictions which is pretty good but then I ended up coming back to 500 with the Seahawks falling to the Packers 28 to 23 in the last game of the weekend I thought the Seahawks had a chance to go into Lambeau and pull off the upset here and they came close in the end but the slow start really just came back to haunt them weren't able to keep up with Aaron Rodgers and the Packers in the end so the championship round next weekend will start with the six seed Titans visiting the second seed Chiefs on Saturday afternoon and then it'll be the second seed Packers visiting the first seed 49ers on Sunday so what do I see coming for these two games well the first one it's certainly an interesting story right and the Titans did beat the Chiefs earlier this season but I don't think they're gonna have the same luck the second time around I think the Chiefs showed you just how powerful they are when they're on top of their game and I think it's gonna be really tough for lightning to strike three times in a row for Derrick Henry and the Titans they could prove me wrong They've certainly done that all the way through the playoffs so far, but for now, I'm going with the favorite. I'm going with the Chiefs. And then the NFC Championship game, I think I'm going to go against some people this one. I'm going to take the visiting Packers. The 49ers certainly had the convincing win over the Vikings, but I think this one will be a little bit closer. I believe in the Packers' defense a little bit more after what they just did to Russell Wilson and the Seahawks. And in a big game situation, which quarterback do I believe in more? I think it's got to be Aaron Rodgers over Jimmy Garoppolo. So I'm taking the Packers to squeak this one out over in San Francisco. So those are my picks for the championship round. I've been two for four each of the previous two weeks here so far. So I'd like to go two for two here if possible, but it'll be interesting. Two really good games here with a lot of storylines between them. I think it'll be some fun football to watch. And of course, I'll be back to react to all of it next week and talk about the Super Bowl in which two teams will be headed to Miami. But that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time.